Hi, I'm Don Beardsley with B3 Innovations. I've traveled down here to Southern Florida to meet with a uh, industry associate and introduce the bucket brackets and the bucket scraper. We had a chance to use them and I'd like Norm's impression uh, of what he felt uh, they added to the small batch mixing. Don, that is just an incredible innovation. I have uh, been in the small batch mixing uh, business for quite some time and as you know when we start mixing products and it starts to set up a little bit you know how the bucket spins and we always end up with uh, one or two or three guys holding these buckets down uh, to keep them mixing and with the bucket bracket it fits on the buckets perfectly uh, you stand on them and they have been just a wonderful innovation for us uh, it saves us time it saves us uh, uh, money it gets keeps our production up uh, it keeps our men safe no more standing on the buckets like they used to in mm -hmm. the old days. Uh, it is just an absolute fabulous product. How did you come up with that idea? Uh, like yourself, I've been in the business a number of years and struggled with that very uh, part of the small batch mixing. The pail wanted to spin, it wanted to tip, product was lost, sometimes small injuries occurred and uh, it came to me that this was a way to improve that whole small batch mixing process. The feedback from the contractors uh, in the Northeast where I started uh, has been very positive. They see the benefits, uh, they're using them, and it uh, it's, makes me feel good that I came up with something to uh, solve the problem. Yes, it certainly did. The issue of safety is, is very critical these days, and with that bucket bracket, the way it holds the bucket in place, there's no more tipping, uh, there's no more spinning, no more accidents. Mm -hmm. uh, it's just an absolute fabulous innovation. Yeah, and some of the contractors I've dealt with have told me at the end of the day they've actually saved quite a bit in labor, which to a contractor, labor is the big item. Time is money, so absolutely. If they can save, save money and prevent injuries, everybody benefits. Tell me about the bucket scraper. That was another product that, uh, again, watching people in the field, material builds up on the sides of the pail. They all have bonding agents in them. And during halfway through the process, invariably, a margin trial would come out, the mixer would bend over, scrape that material back into the pail, and continue mixing. Well, 30, 40 bags it causes back fatigue, and it slows down the whole process. The bucket scraper is used, uh, they don't have to bend, it's Teflon coated, it slides down to the bottom, where sometimes there's dry, unincorporated material, so you're saving material, you're saving the back of the guy doing the scraper, doing the uh, mixing. That was one of the issues we always had with mixing small batches, is getting around the edges and of course, always getting to the bottom. Right. The uh, bucket scraper has just been a, a fabulous uh, tool for us in the industry. Uh, our buckets, when we empty them out, are so much cleaner and so much more product being mixed in the batch versus all the material that used to be just stuck to the sides sure. of, the, of the pail. That's good. Again, saving time, saving money. Absolutely.